South Korea said on Friday it was on heightened alert ahead of another important anniversary in North Korea with a large concentration of military hardware amassed on both sides of the border amid concerns about a new nuclear test by Pyongyang. Now, U.S. officials have said there was a higher than usual level of activity by Chinese bombers, which could signal a possible heightened state of readiness by Beijing. And in Russia, a Kremlin spokesman declined to comment on media reports that Russia was moving military hardware and troops toward the border with North Korea. And U.S. and South Korean officials have been saying for weeks that the North could soon stage another nuclear test, which of course is in violation of U.N. sanctions. But I don't think that Kim Jong-un is too concerned about U.N. sanctions. North Korea is set to mark the 85th anniversary of the foundation of its Korean People's Army. And this is an important anniversary that comes at the end of major winter military drills. And this is from South Korea's Unification Ministry spokesman, Lee Duck Hang. Now, Donald Trump has told a news conference that, quote, some very unusual moves have been made over the last two or three hours, end quote. But he was confident that Chinese President Xi Jinping would, quote, try very hard, end quote, to pressure North Korea over its nuclear and missile programs. So evidently, the USS Carl Vinson carrier group is about to arrive here in the arena. Um, there has been some question as to exactly when that would arrive. And again, we have a heightened state of alert over the possibility of a nuclear test by Kim Jong-un. We will see what we will see, ladies and gentlemen. But do not be given over to the spirit of fear but of the power of love and of a sound mind, which comes through our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Please give this video a thumbs up. Please hit the subscribe button. If you feel so led, check out the links to my fiction books and my music. This is Jim saying God bless you, and I will see you soon.